everybody. We are at the Rice Conference in Hong Kong today, and we are lucky to have Kenny from Moy Hennessy. He is the head of digital transformation here to share with us some lessons learned and also interesting stories from from Moy Hennessy. Welcome, Kenny. Thank you, Xin Thank Xin. you for joining us. Thank you for having me. Can you actually share with us, you know, what the um, what's the strategy and also the direction for Moy Hennessy in terms of digital transformation? Sure. So one of the things that we, our company would like to do is mm -hmm. to transform the way we do business mm -hmm. through the adoption of technology. Mm -hmm. So in a way to make us more, work more efficient and to deliver our customer promise. Mm -hmm. That would be our overall missions uh, in this journey. Yeah. So how are you actually achieving that or like implementing this strategy? So if you talk about digital transformation, actually there's five key elements mm -hmm. that we need to manage. So first is about of course, it's about technology. Mm -hmm. Second is data, it's because we're going to have new data uh, compared with what we had in the past. This is also including internal data and also external data, or what we call big data. Mm -hmm. There's three, the third one is about processes. So we could not have just the new technologies, but using the old processes. So we need to also managing the new processes. It's also part of the change. Mm -hmm. The fourth is about the use case. Mm -hmm. uh, what is the benefits to the business? Mm -hmm. We are not adopting all the latest and greatest, but we need to identify the use case for our business. Mm -hmm. And the fifth the, or final one, or, or last but not least, is about the people, which is normally yes. the most challenging <laughs> and most difficult part mm -hmm. that we need to manage. I that would be the five elements. Interesting, yeah. So you already touched upon the five elements and for you, what are the most challenging pieces or some like really challenging elements or things that you encounter during that process? As you mentioned, it's digital transformation is more like a process and a journey. Mm -hmm. So in this journey, what are the challenges you faced? So the most challenging yeah. uh, area that I would like to highlight or to share is definitely, as I mentioned, it's about the people. Mm -hmm. uh, as I said, I think a lot of companies been caught up by just the latest and greatest. Mm -hmm. We often talk about the new technologies like AI, mm -hmm. blockchain, so machine learning and mm -hmm. so on. But if we don't manage people or we, mm -hmm. we don't manage the organization in terms of the culture, mm -hmm. in, in terms of the way of working, mm -hmm. it will not create any values. Mm -hmm. You can, you can spend millions of dollars on a technology, mm -hmm. but if at the end of the day, if the business or if the people is not adopting the technology, it creates no values. Yeah, so I heard really interesting points from actually what you said. So you talk about people, talk about value, and you also talk about user cases and customer experience. How do you actually connecting those using digital means or using the technology that you are looking at? Mm. Okay, so I think the key elements, as I, as I said, is managing people. Mm -hmm. uh, when we say managing people, is always fall under the topics like change management. Mm -hmm. uh, so in this aspect, so basically we need to have a stringent uh, change management plan. Mm -hmm. So basically you have to, first of all, tell the people about what's the driver for change, mm -hmm. why I have to change. Uh, Motivation, basically. Because motivate, uh, yeah. this is first thing about mm -hmm. awareness. Mm -hmm. uh, and then people are aware that digital come, becomes uh, like a, a key role in, this, in, in the today way of doing business. Mm -hmm. And then the second step you have to build is to build awareness uh, among mm -hmm. the different people in organizations. Mm -hmm. It cannot be one size fit all. Mm -hmm. You have to be really specific what does it mean for me mm -hmm. as, for example, as a director, mm -hmm. as a manager, or as a sales rep, or mm -hmm. as a, like a, even accounting clerk or mm -hmm. whatever. So you have to really specific in terms of having, creating different motivations. You need to communicate what is it in for me mm -hmm. uh, among different level in the organization. Yeah. So what kind of value do you bring to each different roles of the Yes, so what it, what's, what's it in for me? What, what, what does it benefit me? as an employee, yeah. so why I have to change? That's so I think that would be the first question that our business need to, need to answer themselves. Yeah. Uh, why, why are the benefits? Mm -hmm. because, yeah. if you, because we often talk about change management, people will think about top-down. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, people seem to be like the most easiest way to do just top-down. Mm -hmm. 
but at the end of the day, if you just too top down, you may get the quantity of data. If you're just talking about adopting a certain technologies or mm -hmm. systems, mm -hmm. top down can maybe you can make people input the system mm -hmm. in terms of the data, mm -hmm. but you cannot bring quality of data because if just top down, I'm just doing for the sake of doing it. I'm doing maybe it's not for myself, mm -hmm. it's for someone else. Yeah. So even you get the quantity of data, but you were not able to get the quality of data if they don't understand what's it in for me. Yeah. Again, it's the value that yes. you're creating. Yes, yeah. you're creating values mm -hmm. themselves as an employee, mm -hmm. as a user, and also how we motivate them. Mm -hmm. So at the end of the day, if you adopt this technology, mm -hmm. it can help them to make their, their own goals. Mm -hmm. Because everyone should have a, like a personal goals. Mm -hmm. uh, so you have to connect the dots. Mm -hmm. You have to connect it up what they are trying to achieve yeah. and how technology as an enabler mm -hmm. to help them to achieve this in a more efficient way or more easier way to That's achieve really their, their goals. Mm -hmm.